What is your favorite memory of us? Me and you. So what do you can't say in public? How about that? Favorite memory? <laughs> Somebody can't. How about that, mommy? <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. It's your girl Kadeen, and as you can see here, this is a mommy. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Hi guys. <laughs> All right. As you can see from the title of tonight's video, we'll be doing um, a heart to heart, mom, mommy and daughter heart to heart. I have some questions here that I got from the internet. Mommy kind of nervous. I'm not sure exactly why she's so nervous because and Alexa like, Mega asked her no embarrassing questions yes, or provocative said, questions yes strap a session of the video <laughs> anyway so you can't have a girls night without wine so tonight we're going to be having um albino armani which is a pinot green hill so, yeah. i might may not drink the wine already the mommy want more <laughs> show up the more all right Put this away. Okay. Let me get my book with my questions. Thank you. How are you feeling, mommy? I'm good. You, you don't. You feel about the questions? Is that your nerves? You still have? You still feel nervous? I don't know. But I understand why you don't trust me. Like you've known me for thirty-one years. Why you don't trust me? Yet? And the diamonds you won't have me in your belly. As you guys know, I recently moved back home. Someone asked mommy, Mommy, how do you feel that I'm back home? Well, for me, it's great to have you back home, but I don't know about you. If you're Can I ask about you? <laughs> me, me ask about you. How you feel? I am glad that you're back home. Okay, so does it look like I am happy to be home? Yes. Okay. Yes. I, I'm, I'm happy to be home, mother. You know, some of the things. Unless me want to be. <laughs> so if I'm here, I me want to be here. All right. Do you see any similarities between me and you as a child? When you were a child? Oh I mean, my as a child. God. Do you see any similarities? I think you have too much of me. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean by too much of you? The quietness. I'm not quiet um, again. Well, yes. <laughs> Okay, so like the forgiving, you know, the lovingness, the easy to forgive and, you know, forget about some things. Some, some people might hurt you and you just easily forget about it and forgiveness, which I always should have still, but... Well, I won't. I'm not going to forget. I'm not going to forget. Okay. Well, that is a good thing. Yeah, it's a good thing. So forgiveness is good. All right. I know your best friend. Do you know your best friend? You have the same best friend from you were like what five years old? Seven, eight. On the well, region. yeah, below below ten. Yes, on the you ten. Know? Mm -hmm. I'm at thirty one now, so you can imagine they've been best friends for years. This is my auntie Dame, my color, any and everything. <laughs> what was Auntie Dame like as a child? I was put Dame in the white god. <laughs> Dame was like the the fire. Still so, is. <laughs> When we quiet about something, she a defender. She always tried to defend me. You yes, still don't make them do that? Yeah, <laughs> she was a type of person. That's so like Jodie. She stand up for me in everything because I was so quiet. People always wonder, how comes me and Demi? I said, how comes me and Demi friend? How comes, we are fine. How comes me and Demi friend? That Demi is like this. The opposite. Opposite person. But, but she has, but she have the biggest heart. And she, ha she has she the, has biggest, the biggest heart. heart. And what well, yeah, you afraid of so much different things? <laughs> so simple things yeah, that you're afraid of. And she gave me business from that. She has a biggest heart. She has a, she has a big but yeah, heart. But yeah, everybody, I feel like everybody She's needs. She's the best. Like every quiet, reserved person who, you know, grew up reserved and defenseless, basically, kind of needs somebody like that. Like, that was Jodine mm -hmm. for me. 
And then when Miss got high school, Saniki went kind of like a person and Cleo, you know, definitely defend me until me learn to, you know, <laughs> stand up on my own two feet, right? All right. Third question. What is your favorite memory of us? Me and you. So much. <laughs> you don't have one favorite? You can't pick one. You can't pick one? Think about what, what is the first thing on your mind? What am I going to say in public? How about that? Favorite memory? <laughs> Somebody can't. How about that, mommy? <laughs> they can't say on YouTube. No, can't say. That they find your brain? Yeah. You can't whisper in any ears? No. <laughs> <laughs> All right, fine. What, one, what? Of them, one of them stand out, and I think I still have it, you know. I think it was even before you start go school. You yeah, um draw this thing this thing on the paper and said, um it wasn't even mothers, even though when you learn about mothers they are birthday or something, but you learn you, I think you just got that word or hear about that word. And you cross a piece of paper and come and give it to yourself. Mommy, here's your here's your present. Something like that. Here's a present. I love you, mommy. Aww. <laughs> like I think I still have the piece of paper some. Oh you never show me it, mommy. Remember. You never I think show sure me there, it. I think, I think I still have it though. You never show me it. Some cross up, cross up, or a book leaf. <laughs> All right. What were you like as a child? I mean, you know, I've heard stories of, you know, what you were like as a child. But what were you like as a child? <laughs> I was very quiet. I thought so until my brother gave me this name, Mother Fire. <laughs> so no, don't, but mommy, your face is true. I don't know how I come by that name, but no, but your face is true, and you just you would just say it like you would just mommy sharp. Yeah, I thought that was quiet mommy. You're sharp. Nice. No, you have to cross my mother if she get to get that part of her. So I'll probably provoke your brother. Then when I provoke you, forget all that. Mm-hmm. But you know, you know, you're not gonna just lash immediately. But when you lash, <laughs> <laughs> you lash. <laughs> I don't know, no, it's like a quiet storm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> All right. I'm quiet. Mm, can't humble. You say that? Yeah, you're humble. Can't you just say you're quiet? Where, um, when were you the proudest of me? I've always been proud of you. When were you the proudest of me? No, I say there was a point where you're never proud of me. Like, like, you know, when we do something, you feel like, wow, that girl, that my daughter, you know? <laughs> I don't know because the, the things that you're, you you have done, I've already have it in myself that that's what she's gonna do. So I don't know. I can't pick up that very point. That you very didn't know so mega be um. I mean, the no, YouTube and first check when they show. But you know about the oh. internet thing, oh YouTube thing. Cause I always say seeing you on TV or on the radio. You or never something tell like me that. that. That's in my mind. I always always and in my mind. So one day one of them, she's gonna be on TV. Or she's gonna be in the public eyes. You or, thought but, that? Yes, yes, I did. Mm-hmm. I knew this to me. Always in my mind. So now me I do all in something no surprise. No surprise. Me. So nothing at all. Me do no surprise. Me. Nothing at all. You sure? Sure, sure. <laughs> Except for the other. <laughs> 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 no way. I was supposed to be okay. No, you. Yeah. No surprise me. So, so when my pastor was so they say you, you didn't know that. I yes. I did know that. But my past me say, see, you knew that. Mm-hmm. Girl, you, you and I guess sometimes when you see, sometimes you might just say, what oh, do you feel now? You don't no show no emotion, no, no pharma thing. Because I already know already. Yeah, but because me, I know, say, so you know. And I feel like, and for me, it's like, I, I have to push myself yeah. more for try and make it seem as if you. Your 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 proud of me. If you know if you're proud of me, even though you know that you're proud of me. Already so you know, like a... Now that you have this and Ray, like I think we communicate that more now how important it is to say certain things. Mm-hmm. And I guess that's probably because you're quiet. Or and also based on your upbringing, you never get that. So you can't yeah. give what you never have. So that's why now me can't understand it and say you know, mommy love me in the way what she know love and. Me after she proud of me. She say yes. And not not all what me do. Mommy <laughs> not she she did everywhere. She post everything. <laughs> As we said on something she posted. <laughs> so yeah, yeah. I me know no, me know. 
Was there ever a time that you felt worried or af- worried or afraid for me? Yeah. I win that. You sure I must say it. You don't have to call nobody name. <laughs> <laughs> Involving nobody. We don't know what you are talking about. So this is serious and I'm gonna say it then. No, we don't say it. Alright, talk about yeah, I see. Uh, how much time you ever afraid for me? A uh, one time? Just one time. That are recently? No. Since here? Mm-hmm. When that? From a couple of years back. When that? When? What that? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> they can't oh. say when we get number first relationship. Mm-hmm. She saw things that I was not able to see in my um, naivety. <laughs> there was a time when I never really knew much. I was sheltered. She was able to see certain things. I remember mean, they said, Teddy, you know, things say, you know, things say, I said, no, this is it. This is it. I can't laugh to know because as mom say, you know, I mean, I'm a person who will grow, I learn, I heal, I forgive, I move on. But I mean, I regret to do it. I don't regret it. You might regret it for me, but I don't regret it because you learn a lot. You learn a lot. All right. What accomplishment are you proudest of? Finishing a degree, probably. Finishing and my bachelor's? I, yeah, when I started, yeah. Um, yo, when I finished started. When I started my master's? When I started my master's. But then, I don't accomplish that yet. I don't say I accomplish it, but you know, starting it, I, I still, you know, say they go done. You know, say they go finish. I can ask mm-hmm. one part B of the question here. Have it, is having my master's important to you? In a sense. Like, how would that make you feel if I have my master's? Even if I probably not use it? Probably. Mm, that's a, what I, I don't know. I think that I want to. I don't know if I have parents or everybody, but that's one that that of my dreams. They say, me never have, me not get it, so you're supposed to have it. Or right. oh, you'd want me to have I it? I would love for it, right? I can't understand that. But what if I decide to not go finish it? I'll still be happy. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I want to finish it still. Mm. No, but I want to finish it. What was your relationship like with your parents as a child? Me, mm. man. <laughs> mm. I don't know. My father wasn't there. And um, my mother. I think she had too much of us, uh, but not too much now because we are the problem then it was too much when I was small. Oh. Like too much for her to give yes. the attention on the need. But no, I wouldn't do a thing. There's nothing that I would do not to have in them now, the amount of all of us now. For you those know. of you who don't know, how many brothers are? Brothers are? Um, eight. Eight of us, eight brothers. Eight brothers, two sisters. And two sisters. So. And I wouldn't tra- trade them for anything <laughs> right now. So that's 11 of you? Yeah. I wasn't around all of them the whole time. It was three of us particularly that we were together, close and so your parents basically weren't present during childhood then? No. Because grandma true. couldn't be there right. physically mm-hmm. and your father just... But now as an adult, do you think your relationship with your mother, because you know, my grandfather hit the bucket, the girl from her, I mean, they, you know, so... But before he died, did the relationship with him change? He tried to reach out to us after a while and everybody get big. And I've seen where he try to come around when the grandchildren start coming. You yeah, can we remember him. Mm-hmm. Remember vividly him with wine for marijuana. <laughs> he was there for your birth. He was there he was there after you were born and then when Jordan born he was there also. Remember him with honey he used to yeah, rear, honey, yeah. yeah, he used to rear bees. Mm-hmm. So we always have a whole heap of honey. And we just feel like we always him spirit kind of remind me of Uncle Clans. Yeah. Like he just never allow anything. But me remember, he never allow anything for bother me. Always a smile. Remember when I was skinny man? He always a laugh, always a smile. Granddad, grand whatever. And then long because he died when 97, right? When yeah, 6. 97. Even have but the vivid memory when I always had like nothing about him. 
<laughs> but what about grandma? Like your relationship with grandma changed, or like were you able to build a relationship with grandma? Cause mm-hmm. yeah, yeah. All right. What was your biggest fear about having us, your children? Well, my biggest fear was that um, raising you guys alone. You think right? you're gonna raise me alone? That was one of my fear. That was one of my fear that having a child and I have to raise them on my own without a father because I have grown up without a father. Yeah. Oh. I get you. Because you had us pretty well. You never know, was in your teenage years, but you have a young, young enough. So you feel like daddy ain't gonna run away? Mm-hmm. <laughs> man, <I'm> man. <laughs> <laughs> say man, <I'm> man. <laughs> you think say man, 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 man. You know, I would know. I don't know. Well, that was another fear. But you have so cool was though. Left her. You think he would have run away? No, him. Mm. Daddy could be like ticks. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't know. <laughs> well, <laughs> that's my biggest fear. I don't want to raise on by myself. You ain't excited to have children? Yeah. Because I, you know, I always. Um, up and down with my, with my bigger sister and brother, children them. So, at one point, person people were saying, "Why hope you don't go and pick me?" And I kind of repeat it too much. <laughs> I probably that never said about me. Mm, yeah, I was my love for repeat it too much. So, I don't go have none. What? But you're glad, and you, you see your fear never come to actualization. Cause mm-hmm. I'm blessed with, with two of the best, and that is still the road. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Enough trouble. God and spray. Daddy, daddy. One day, I will bring him on the channel and have one heart to heart with him. <laughs> All right, last question from me. I don't know if you have no question for me. But my last question What was the most rewarding thing about raising us? Seeing you guys uh, pass the worst. What is the worst? Said that. <laughs> the worst of the worst. Like, I no, you, you mean, I mean like, you can't say it for yourself. I, I, I think that is the worst that they want to say. You don't depend on us anymore after a certain age. You can you can fed for yourself. You can stand your bill. You can feed yourself. You can do your own thing without asking us for anything. And I think you go more than just like mm-hmm. physical, but you basically so we go out there yeah. and face right. certain things and take on the world and decide say, all right, we're gonna do this and we're gonna confident and confidently do it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Well, so how you feel now that you have. You know, children and grandchildren, and you know, we're still around. <laughs> we still kick it. No, that we're not gone off of the bunkers yet. <laughs> you feel like, what's the word? When I say, like, you feel like you do your best. I think I've done my best. I'm proud of myself. <laughs> not that mission is completed, but. You know, the mission was well, so <laughs> <I'm here. laughs> Mission complete. Mission yeah. complete, yes. Mission complete. Well, we passed the words. Now we come back home. <laughs> <laughs> Life for a rough foot. Life for a rough foot. I think you're a child. Life for a rough foot is a matter of come back. <laughs> Guess what? That's what sometimes. Sometimes you really have to relive your childhood days. When you decide to come out, when nobody never send you out. <laughs> Say this, you have to come back. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. If it went up to you, I'm going to move out any other time. Mm-hmm. I'm going to move out any other time. But we spent eight years at my own. So and I chose to come back. Now become a broke before. Now become a broke and I need to rescuing. But, you know. I know that you leave before. No. You leave before the time. So you have to come back and relive it. And no, the, no, because. <laughs> no coming back here. Totally different from when men leave. Like, I want a whole different dynamic. A whole different layouts, like my situation now, totally different. Being on my own, mature me in a one way where I can navigate the world or my space or whatever I'm presented with. When we move out, we couldn't do certain things. There's, there's a lot that I couldn't do when we just move out. I never understand which part I go pay a bill. Me never know a lot of things. No jump here, no jump here. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm proud of myself. <laughs> Because they never, nobody then throw me out and say, "Go call me." Me choose to come back. I'm gonna come back with everything, with my dignity intact yeah. as well. I'm so kind again still. <laughs> you know, so me I roll this stone, but I get a normal. Anyway, mommy, you have no question for me. Mm-hmm.
one then I've known question as a why you decide to come back home? <laughs> why would you decide to come back? I think I went time. I think it was that like I was looking at when I want to leave the apartment, when I want somewhere different. And I mean, I said, if I go live anywhere, you know, there is a certain way where you see, what I see. But I want, like, I want one apartment where holy people light to come in. Like, that was <laughs> very important to me. I want people light to come in. I want more space because, you know, with the artwork and so forth. And then especially because when I work from home now, I was like, boy, I want, I want it to be somewhere where I feel at peace and happy. So much things are not going on in my life. And I say, no, I need a change of scenery. And when we go away, oh, when I go overseas, I will buy the um, I will go in a what place name Home Goods and buy the the plate drain. I say all right, me know which part me. Cause me didn't know say me I go moving on. We just never know where. <laughs> when we buy the, <laughs> I will buy the dish, <laughs> the dish drain. And I say the only place where this I go look good. I don't want don't, is home. And the only place in the kitchen. In the apartment at home and that's why i said all right may i move come on when we tell mom i said i move come on she couldn't be, she never believed me she said mm, we'll see <laughs> <laughs> she said we'll see anyway moving until we drink another one happy to be home let's drink some but yeah the day but still you know me happy me put on weight you know me not have to worry about certain things i mean no so when they're right there so if me need to know we can run gonna say if if you need me you know me the right there, so so how was this video for you, mommy? Alright. Okay. You know, you know, you know, you know. <laughs> yes, you say no need to be nervous. <laughs> yes, you say no need to be nervous. Guys, thank you so much for having a sip of wine with Cads and Mommy. I hope that you enjoyed this video as much as we enjoyed making it. Don't forget to like, comment, and what is I supposed to do, mommy? Subscribe. Subscribe. <laughs> Subscribe to the channel. Turn on the notification bell so that you can see every time that I upload. I'm not consistent. Come and hold the things I do. So just turn on the notification bells, please, so that you can see when we upload. All right. Thank you. And stay tuned for more. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Cheers, mommy. <laughs> <laughs>